1966 is a very special number. It just happens to be the year that a certain TV show we all know and love first hit the airwaves. It also happens to be the number of pieces issued in a very special item commemorating one of those characters. Here's a clue, and here's a clue. Happy birthday, Barbara Gordon. It's a special anniversary year for this Batgirl, and Diamond Select Toys has crafted for us a lovely and quite heavy statue of our girl here, Batgirl, as portrayed by Yvonne Craig in the 1966 Batman TV series. There were 1,966 of these made, and you are looking at number, ooh, 1,440. <laughs> and, um, you know, we talk about the number 1966 because that was the year that the TV show debuted starring Adam West and Burt Ward. But Yvonne Craig came along in the third season um, in September 1967, actually. And this version of Batgirl was introduced in the comics in January of 1967. So that's why in 2017, we are celebrating 50 years of the Barbara Gordon Batgirl all year long. And I'll just um, brief note, I keep saying Barbara Gordon Batgirl because there have been other Batgirls over the years. We touched on the history of Batgirl and Bat ladies in general in an earlier episode of Terrific TV Toys. And there's been, in more modern times, there's been a Batgirl who was actually Stephanie Brown, a Batgirl who was Cassandra Kane. So there have been other Batgirls, but this... This is our Batgirl. <laughs> so this is the one that we are talking about. Now the page on the Diamond Select Toys website that describes this particular piece says, the Batgirl of your dreams is now the centerpiece of your statue collection. And while my dreams <laughs> regarding this particular Batgirl were probably different from the usual, oh, you know, fanboy's dreams. I really wanted to be her. I didn't want to date her or anything like that. <laughs> this statue does still become the centerpiece of my collection, however, just like the website says. It kicks the butt of basically anything else I have in my collection in the Batcave downstairs. I'm being very careful, you'll notice, and holding both parts because... She comes off the base very easily. In fact, I'm just going to detach her from the base for a moment. So you can see a little detail that's actually a three-dimensional logo on top of this very heavy, heavy base. And then for her, you have the wonderful flared out cape. You have the detail in her face. And her hair, now her hair looks pretty brown to me. They made an attempt at red human hair or the kind of red haired wig that she wore on the show. Um, it does come off a little bit brown. It looks even browner through the screen here than it does in real life. Um, and there's her purple sparkly outfit with boots. Those are just literally just posts coming out of her feet that fit her on the stand. And all very heavy, nicely made. Let's put her back on this thing. I got this. I think it's a Christmas gift last year, I believe, and it is just beautiful. In fact, if you look at the box, Here's what she came in, and um, this little detail of the Batmobile, and on the back it says, in 1968, well, <laughs> I guess you could say it was the 1967-68 TV se season, a new character joined the cast of the Batman Classic TV series. She was Barbara Gordon, daughter of Commissioner Gordon, and when she wasn't working at the Gotham City Library, she was defending its streets from criminal miscreants. In her team-ups with Batman and Robin, Batgirl d 
defied the prevailing thought of the era that women could not be crime fighters. In fact, her powerful kicks and mechanical know-how frequently turned the dynamic duo into a terrific trio. And isn't that the truth? This statue, it says, is sculpted by Claiborne Moore. It's resin, and it stands approximately 12 inches tall. And it is so cool. So look for more episodes this year celebrating Batgirl. We have so much Batgirl stuff down there. As you saw at the beginning of this episode, we're going to do a bunch of episodes, at least one a month with a Batgirl thing of some kind um, celebrating the Barbara Gordon Batgirl. She was, of course, on other TV shows. She was on the Batman animated series in the 1990s. She was on The Batman comma, animated series <laughs> a little bit later in more recent years. And so we've got other stuff that we can show you. Stay tuned.